Uh, sure, Shane A. Bassett, uh, Triple M National Australia. Hello. Hi, Shane, how are you? Hey, I'm doing really well. Thank you for your time. You look amazing. Thank you, Thank you so much. So do you. <laughs> Thank you. Very early in the morning in Sydney. Oh, dear. <laughs> have you ever been to Australia? I have not, but I would love to. I've been like meaning to visit for so long and I just haven't had the time but, or the opportunity, but I would love to. Lots of, lots of Australian projects here, so there's opportunities. <laughs> Fingers crossed. <laughs> uh, tell me about walking onto the set of Snake Eyes. How did you feel? Like, did you take it all in? I mean, it was incredible, you know, especially the practical um, locations in Japan was just so, like, beautiful. And uh, you can actually, you know, feel the, the history in the air and, you know, on your skin. And I think yeah. it definitely helped all the, the actors to kind of, you know, um, embrace the characters and have that authentic authenticity uh, yeah. but yeah it was it was really incredible and I can't wait to watch them on the big screen because they are absolutely gorgeous <laughs> uh, did you do any of your own stunts oh I think most actors did well all the actors did most of our own stunts um Fantastic. Yeah, it was it was um, definitely challenging but so enjoyable now the Cannes Film Festival is on at the moment do you think uh, Snake Eyes would get a standing ovation if it was played. <laughs> I mean, I'd imagine they're a tough crowd, but yeah, I mean, it's a fun film. So, you know, I'm sure people there would have had a blast if it was on there. Um, how did you get the role? W was there an audition process or were you handpicked by the director? Uh, no, I had uh, two auditions. I had a self-tape audition, which is, you know, when actors have to like take their own yes. audition and send it in. And then I got a recall um, a month after that, maybe, maybe not even, maybe three weeks after my first um, tape audition where yeah. um, Lorenzo was there in person and the producer and, um, and yeah, Roberts, the director was on Zoom uh, because my audition, the recall was in, Lo in London, but yeah. Yes. Uh, are you finding there's more opportunities for diversity in um, acting and uh, are you getting lots of opportunities to play different roles? Absolutely. I mean, like I've had loads of auditions um, the past, you know, a uh, couple of years and the roles I get to audition for are definitely becoming more um, interesting. They, yep. It's not necessarily written specifically for um, to be Asian, but yep. people seem to be open to like all ethnicities, including Asian, because the character doesn't rely on any ethnic background, uh, which I think is great because I think we need to keep keep seeing these, um, you know, all sorts of um, ethnicity and people of like yes. backgrounds in like normal roles, like everyday roles. Um, so I think that's a, that's a great start. Uh, can you surf? I cannot, I wish. <laughs> uh, one of our actresses, um, Eri, who's playing the leader of um, our yes. show, she surfs. And I think that's so cool. <laughs> um, tell me about your history with G.I. Joe and, and Snake Eyes. Were you aware of the uh, project or, how, well, you know, what's I your have, legacy? I have to admit, I didn't grow up playing with like G.I. Joe toys or watching the cartoons or reading the comics because I... Sure. You know, I'm the eldest of like two or uh, three sisters. So yep. I didn't really have anyone who introduced me to the world of G.I. Joe, although I was aware of it for sure. So I I was very excited to, um, when I got the audition, I was very excited that, you know, I got to, um, you know, read for one of the characters. And, and final question, did um, your role, your um, significant small role in 47 Ronin, did that uh, sort of prepare you for Snake Eyes? I mean, I guess everything kind of leads to, you know, so I guess so. I mean, it definitely prepared me to, because that was my first um, time working on the big Hollywood set. So yes. in that sense, yes. All right. Lovely to meet you. I hope I uh, bump into you in Australia sometime. Take care. Too. Thank you so much. Bye. Bye. <laughs>